Sentences this man to life in prison twice over for two counts of first degree murder. A jury found John Park Sr. guilty of gunning down two people inside outside a hotel. It was a case of mistaken identity. Okay, TV News Watch 7 Sarah Feely spoke with one of the families and shares what Parks said in court. He's just an evil person, and I'm glad it's over with. It's been three years too long. Dorothy Hatton Scott is talking about John Parks Sr., the man who shot and killed her daughter, Nicole Hatton, in July 2020. Parks also killed Michael Harbour, thinking he'd seen a video of his son being murdered on Harbour's phone. But that video was from Mexico and was not Parks' son. She was a beautiful, loving person. She worked hard. She took care of family. And Mike, he was a great friend of hers. In fact, Harbour and Hatton had grown up with Parks, according to Harbour's sister. Parks says he didn't do anything, didn't get a fair trial, and spoke to the family, saying, quote, we can sit here all day and say all the beautiful things about a person, but we know who these people are, end quote. Before the sentence, prosecutors submitted evidence of Parks' time spent in federal prisons, asking the judge to label him a habitual criminal under Nebraska law. Judge Dwayne Doherty did, sentencing Parks to life twice over, plus 80 years to run consecutive to each other. I'm excited, overwhelmed, and also sad because it's never going to bring the code back. Hatton Scott told the judge she did not know what evil was until she saw Mr. Parks. Harbor's sister called Parks the devil, saying he was Satan's right-hand man, adding, quote, We've waited for this day for so long, but it truly will not mend our broken hearts, especially when you killed the wrong person. Both families say they will leave this grief in the past, focusing on moving forward for both Harbor and Hatton's children. They say today is justice and victory. Sarah Feely, KETV, Newswatch 7.